Information flows through the ether if you can tune into it. Jin Ven, that's true. 100%. There is a Russian physicist named Ishak Bentov. He might be Jewish, I don't know. But Ish, his name is Ishak Bentov wrote uh, Stalking the Wild Pendulum and a brief tour, tour of higher consciousness. You see how I pulled those two titles out of my head? Just like that. Information is already in the holography surrounding us. Jinbin, you're absolutely correct. We can, we can tap into that through intent through will, and through altruism. The very act of wanting to benefit another soul trapped in this holography grants you temporal powers to do that benefit. I see it all the time. But you're absolutely correct. You pull information out of the air. The brain is the brain is a capacitor. It doesn't house anything. It doesn't house the spirit. And it doesn't house the soul. What the brain does is emotions like empathy, emotes, sadness, Anger, these are spiritual qualities. Uh, intuition, imagination, none of those have anything to do with the brain. That's all spiritual qualities. What the brain does is it processes what, what it's receiving in the ether, the information from the, the immortal spirit, and it's translating that into cortisols and dopamines and chemicals that the brain produces so the avatar will respond in kind. It's just the opposite of what psychologists are telling you. But then again, the establishment's always telling you the opposite of the truth. 